Okay, guys. So, I know you guys were hoping for an edit or thinking that this was going to be an edit video. No, this is actually going to be a long kind of explanation type video. So, if you don't like those videos, you can click off the video. But this is to all the true fans that want to know how I started and stuff like that. And what has happened to me through the past four years. So today, May 17th, 2018, is my fourth year on YouTube. And yes, I know I've been doing this for four years and I have about 560-something, 69 subs last I checked. Alright, dip in, I'm sorry. But, um, yeah. So I want to kind of start out when I started. So when I started, I was actually, I just moved into this house. And we just got internet, and I was like, because I used to be so, I think the word's infatuated, or infatuated, I don't know if I'm wrong, sorry, but like, so fascinated, that's the word, so fascinated with, with it, doing YouTube, so I was like, you know what, I'm going to create a YouTube channel, record myself playing Minecraft, and you know, probably Call of Duty, so I did. I was in sixth grade. I was twelve years old. I started May seventeenth, two thousand and fourteen, and started just recording my gameplay with my old phone. I had a crappy, crappy phone, and I would record some random vlogs. And I, you know, it was kind of slow at first. I think it took me a year to hit a hundred subs. And when I hit that 100 subs, um, I was so excited. Um, I started, first off, I finally got Black Ops 2 um, during 7th grade year. Um, Mason, my best friend, if you guys didn't know that, that dude is legit my best friend. Um, no way I could replace our friendship. Yeah, so... You get some of you guys didn't actually know that. You guys probably thought Bubba or XCS. XCS is actually one of my good, really good friends. Um, I've actually known him longer than I've known. No, I've known him about the same time I know him as I've known Bubba. So him and Bubba are like the same stage where I talk. No offense to Bubba, me and Bubba are really good friends. Like me and him trust each other a lot, and I'm very thankful to have him as a friend. But me and XCS are more close. And that's because we talk a lot outside of school. But we got into Call of Duty. Or I got into Black Ops 2. Mason gave me a disc for Black Ops 2 because he was getting a new one. Started quick scoping. As you know, I started out quick scoping on Xbox with Miles. He's one of my old one of my good friends. Um he used to be a, he used to be on this channel sometimes. And um, you know, I started on MW, I started on Black Ops 2 on Xbox, but I mostly played Minecraft. Went over to PlayStation, went back to PlayStation. Because I, when I first got on PlayStation, all I did was play Minecraft and Grand Theft Auto 5. But, um, when I got back on PlayStation, I had MW3 and learned how to quickscope on that game. Made a video on how to quickscope, which is not up. I accidentally either privated the video or deleted it, which was stupid. And then... I ended up getting Black Ops 2, like I said, from Mason. Started quick scoping on that game. Um, started my own Clad Tech clan. It was called, um, what was the, game, the clan called? Oh, it was called Vibes or something. And my name was either, I don't know what my name was. I think mine was like, my name was either Vapor or Viper. I don't know, or skills, I think that was my name, and then I joined, I got lucky, and joined a team called Centra, and back then, before I joined Centra, my name on YouTube was Austin Cluck, my actual name, then I, I joined Centra, somehow, they had 1k, I got lucky, I knew a dude that was in the team, he got me in, and I didn't know what to name myself, um, so I just like decided to walk around my house, and I seen a oh, oh also this is the exact place I recorded my 100 sub video except this one my old desk now record it with my phone but I um 
we went around my house and found a Ajax soap bottle and I was like Ajax is a cool name I I don't really ever see anybody playing with Ajax as their gamer tag so I was like you know what just make it Sintra Ajax that was my name well I was just learning to trick shot I was doing 360s and stuff like that we were trick shotting private match with a bunch of the guys I had a 360 and I was freaking out and I told them to end the game they all ended the game and I ended up getting kicked from Sintra and um right before I was getting kicked if you guys know my friend Edley um before I got kicked I told him I was like dude I might be getting kicked from Sintra if I do we are starting our own team and when I got kicked we started Bionic Bionic lasted for about five months I'll say it's the longest time I've been in a team but I've been in in sacrifice since see I joined the beginning of February, February, March, April, May. I've been in sacrifice for four months now. And, well, started Bionic up. Lost a good friend of mine in Bionic. And then I joined Dare. Because I got really good at trick shining somehow. My voice just cracked so bad. I joined Dare. Um, ended up leaving Dare like a day after because I didn't think it was legit. And I didn't really know anything about big teams then and by the way this is in 2015 I'm still doing YouTube still recording my screen stuff like that and then I was just clan hopping like crazy joining teams trying to get into big teams got my PS4 joined a big team called auto uh, became knife team captain because I started knifing um, also was in obey supremacy when I first got my PS4 I um, was an editor and then I became a player for them I hit my first trick shot in Black Ops 3 for the team and my grandma passed away then my great grandma but I was close to her and then joined auto me and Miles did I left auto because I wasn't getting like nobody was really talking to me in the team and then I just started clan hopping again, stuff like that. And about 2016, my channel was starting to pick up in 2016. 2017, it was starting to pick up. I lost two of my nannies last year. Um, one of them was my other great granny, and one of them was my actual, my dad's mom. And then another thing. So that's that's out of the way. Now I'm in Team Sacrifice, and we've been going for four months now. We're doing strong. Um, but a lot of things has happened, like mental health wise, um, since the end of sixth grade. I got dyslexia. I have depression. I have anxiety, and I stress out a lot. So also have. I kind of have a little bit of OCD and a little bit of ADHD. I remember getting my first sponsor was Cinch Gaming, and then I got No Scope and Freedom, which Freedom was a YouTube partnership. And then when I started getting paid from YouTube, I thought, you know, this was it. This is where I start becoming big, but it really wasn't. And then I got sponsored by Razer, as you guys know. They didn't send me this, I got this. Um, I'm all set up. Yeah, Razor. Then got sponsored by Insane Labs. You guys know how that how that stuff is now. Um, still sponsored by Razor and Insane Labs. Um, let's see. Um, my setup wise, my room wise, everything has changed. I started started my setup right in that corner with my old desk with a big flat screen TV and just a PS3. Um, I actually have my first setup video. It's my setup for 100 subs. It it's on this channel. You just have to find it. It's an old video, and that was in like seventh grade. That was with Mason. And my setup has changed now. I've got a blue snowball, got a razor keyboard, got a nice mouse. Well, it's not a nice mouse. I want a new one, but it's fine for right now. I've got a mouse pad. Cost me five dollars for this mouse pad. Logitech webcam was like the first big thing besides my laptop that came to the setup um, got this desk, got these LEDs, got two lamps um, 
what else did I get? Got this USB thing. Got this arm stand. I have a pop filter, but it's in there. Got my vlog set up, which is actually right here. And then that's all of that really. And then what really hit me when I felt like, you know, I might start actually being able to turn this into a job is when the Sand Lab sent me a bunch of stuff for free. And then my views started going up. And then what I have planned for this summer, hopefully if it goes correctly, then I most likely will blow up from this. I can't really say anything right now about it. I'm just letting you guys know it's with TM4P. But for, I want to thank you guys for 10 years on YouTube. Oh, 10 years. Sorry, I was reading the, the clock on my timer. Four years on YouTube. Um, it's been a crazy journey. And I am continue to grow. And continue to do what I do best. And that's make videos. Um, stuff I have planned. I want to do a Clash Royale series again. Um, this thing I was telling you about over the summer. Um, XCS is coming down. And then I'm going to XCS's house. And then... Yeah, that's all really it um, for right now. Now we just have the future. Anyways, guys, it's an Ajax, and I'm out. Peace.